Climate change, it's considered the major challenge of our times. But also an opportunity to build a new society grounded on sustainable development. To attain the goals of the Paris Agreement and limit global warming to 1.5 to 2 degrees and to achieve the sustainable development goals established in the 2030 Agenda, it's imperative to balance societal, economic and environmental aspects, learn from each other and work together for our common future. This is particularly important for the Mediterranean a region with high cultural and environmental values which has become the world's leading tourism destination, while at the same time experiencing the pressures of rapid urbanization and agricultural expansion. The area is also considered as a climate hotspot since changes on temperature and precipitation are faster than other regions. The Navarino Environmental Observatory is a Mediterranean hub for research and education where science, business, society and policy makers join in a pioneer cooperation to create a more sustainable future under a changing climate. NEO was established in 2009 as a collaboration between Stockholm University, the Academy of Athens and Temis SA, an enterprise in Greece aiming to create sustainable tourism developments. The field station is located at Costa Navarino in Messinia, Greece, and it hosts more than 200 visitors every year. Several national and international researchers and students come to NEO to study climate variability, earth and atmospheric sciences, water resources management, and sustainable development of agriculture, fishing, and tourism. NEO provides long-term data through its atmospheric and water monitoring stations and supports understanding the impacts of both natural and human-driven processes on local and regional climate, economy and the environment. At the forefront of water research, research and collaborations at NEO have advanced the capacity of tackling water scarcity, the main challenge in the Mediterranean region, and they have identified future priorities to achieve different SDGs. The data and knowledge generated at NEO have been used by several European research infrastructures and have led to more than 200 publications in international scientific journals so far. Besides scientific experts, NEO engages administrations, entrepreneurs and the society establishing partnerships with policymakers, businesses and local stakeholders. Together, they have developed sustainable business roadmaps and policy recommendations based on science and evidence-based solutions to support decision-making processes at local, regional and European levels. A good example of such collaboration is the Yalova project. The project is funded by a local fish company and aims to suggest scientific and robust solutions for the gradual restoration of Yalova Lagoon, a coastal wetland integrated in the European Natura 2000 network, which has been degraded due to anthropogenic activities and is affected by climate change. Under the Yalova project, Neoscientists, together with colleagues from Greek institutions, technology experts, fishermen, environmental managers, local authorities and foundations, have joined forces to study and co-design how to achieve sustainable fishing, nature conservation and ecotourism development in the years to come. NEO's activities and research outcomes are widely being disseminated namely through national and international conferences and seminars, but also in more informal events like Café NEO, where NEO scientists directly present, discuss and exchange ideas and knowledge with local stakeholders. It takes time and energy to build trust and understanding among the different actors, but NEO achievements so far have proven that we need to learn from each other and work together to co-achieve our goals. For the next years, NEO will continue to study climate change, its impact and interconnection with human societies and ecosystems. To identify water, land and food security issues in the Mediterranean region in relation to socio-economic development 
to develop solutions and business policy roadmaps under ongoing climate and anthropogenic changes in the Mediterranean region. To connect scientists, businesses and policy makers at different levels to discuss challenges of environmental management and sustainable development. The challenges are many, but together we can create a better future.